well, good morning or good evening or whatever it is for you. Um, <clears throat> just wanted to make a real quick video here talking about the folly of the flat earth movement. Um, my first point of why I'm not a flat earther is because it fails the test in James chapter 3. It's not pure, it's not peaceable, easy to be entreated, full of mercy and good fruits and things. It's not that. There's a lot of contention with it. And if you want proof of that, you can look at the comments section. And um, ironically, I went into the YouTube analytics and um, <clears throat> as proof of the folly of the whole movement, uh, the Bible says in Proverbs chapter 18, verse 13, about uh, he that answereth the matter before he heareth it, it is folly and shame unto him. So I went to the YouTube analytics page and it actually showed that the average view duration of the video was only 25% of the video. In other words, these flat earthers are coming out and you can see it in the comments. They're, they're now saying, I am lost. Brian Denlinger is obviously a lost man. He's being paid off by NASA. He's uh, a heretic. He's this, he's that. Judging salvation over the shape of the earth. Okay, chapter, book, chapter, and verse on that one, please. Uh, show me where anybody in the New Testament ever did that. Not one verse. Um, <laughs> but, uh, you know, uh, that's what they're doing. But Denlinger's a heretic. You didn't prove anything, blah, blah, blah. And the average view duration is 25% of the video. I think that could be called answering a matter before you hear it. And wouldn't that be folly and shame? Yes, it would be. So, uh, just thought that was rather interesting there. Um, just another proof that the system of the flat earth thing is not of God. And let me clarify something else that's been said about me, and that is, if somebody believes in flat earth, uh, then, uh, I don't remember exactly how I said it, you know, but about not being welcome at this ministry. What I meant by that is, if you're going to be militantly bringing it up with everything and just questioning people's salvation, then you're not welcome at the ministry. Uh, I don't care what people believe about the shape of the earth. I really honestly don't. Uh, doesn't mean anything to me. But what I'm saying is, if you're there to bring division into the ministry and fight people over the shape of the earth, then you're not welcome at the ministry. I don't care if you believe the earth is flat or triangular or whatever. I, I could care less. Couldn't care less, excuse me. Um, so just to clarify that as well, because I've had that being said about me and things, and maybe I said it wrong. I don't remember exactly what I said in the study, but just to clarify that. But, uh, and the, the other thing too about the 25% viewing time thing, um, you realize that's average. So there were people, you know, faithful brethren out there that actually watched the whole study. And so uh, they're the actual flat earth people. I think it's over 1300 comments or something on that video. The actual flat earth people probably watched it less than 25%. So just a few minutes and all I can judge the guy's salvation because he's not some militant flat earther. So um, congratulations, flat earthers. You have proved militant flat earthers. If you're not a militant one, well, okay. I still don't agree with you, but uh, if you're a flat earther, um, congratulations. Your system has been proven to be folly and shame because the vast majority of the people uh, that commented on the video didn't even watch the whole thing. And nobody answered all the points that I brought out. Not one. Uh, and I had other brethren write me and say, yeah, I went down through all the comments. Nobody answered all the points you brought out. Which is exactly what I knew would happen. So, uh, the ministry will continue. I had a guy write me and he said, your ministry is going down. And other people, you know, uh, saying just crazy, wild stuff about me and everything. And God's going to destroy me and all this other stuff. And... You people are so filled with hate. Uh, you need to repent of that false system of belief. Um, so the Holy Spirit's not led you into that system. Uh, but that's going to be it for this video. Thank you for watching.